Hey everyone, welcome to Campus NRV in Merrimack, New Hampshire. My name is Uncle Bernie and I'm here with my good buddy as usual, Jesse Lambert. But today, instead of doing product videos, we're going to introduce you to some of the members of the Campus NRV family. And we hope you enjoy spending time with our family as much as we enjoy spending time with your family. Hey Jesse, how you doing today? How's it going, Bernie? I'm doing good. Hey, can you tell everybody your name, how long you've been here, and what keeps you here at Camp Resin? You've been around for a while. Hi, uh, yeah. Well, I uh, started in 2002 in Kingston at their location. Yep. Uh, many, many years ago, and so I've been 22 years in the camper business, and uh, you know, the Hirsch family is a fantastic family. The business is built on integrity and taking care of the customer. And that is the most important thing, making sure your experience is a good, happy, and educational time that you spent with us here. Yeah, my name is Junior Farias. I'm an RV matchmaker here. I've been with Brand Location for about a year and a half, been with the company for about four years. And the main thing for me is since the first time I got on board here with the Random Stores, the culture, we strive the best we can to help our customers at the same time. From an individual standpoint, I'll be trying to get better uh, individual pieces of our job. And uh, the fact that even when I was new here, still learning things, and of course, we're always learning. I always had a team in place where I can put any single one of these guys and figure out how to help my customers the best way I can or learn product better. And uh, it was giving me the tools to become the best version of myself. So it's about having a good team around you, having a support system in place so you could do your best. And, uh, you know, Tell us about one of your favorite memories here at Camp Resident in Merrimack. Uh, it was like my first week here. Lance asked me to bring a boat home with the Redmond fleet, and I had never drove a Class A diesel plane in my life. <laughs> but I didn't want to look silly. And uh, I got Jesse Keeman here to help me out, and uh, I didn't crash, and I pulled it off. And ever since then, driving them is like nothing because uh, Jesse K told me how to do it. Now you're a champ. Thanks, brother. All right, thanks a lot. Right there. Bye. Hi, I'm Karen Gray. I'm front desk receptionist. Uh, I started here in 2011, and I left, and then I came back in 2023. Oh, wow. So what brought you back to Camp Resin? Actually, it was one of the uh, sales managers here. Okay. Was previously here, he was in sales, and he was just a, uh, one of the sales team. Now he's the sales manager. Oh, I think so I know who you're talking his about. His name is Lance. His name is Lance. So he asked me to come back, and made everything work the way I needed it to when I came. That's been really nice having you around here and we appreciate the work that you do every single day. Thank you. Yeah. I love being here. I love the team. It's it's awesome. My name is Devin. I'm the production manager at Campers Inn in Merrimack. Um, I started out as a receptionist actually right out of college um, and I loved it over there and helped out with all the sales guys so got pretty close relationships with them. Um, I got moved over to service pretty quickly, a couple months later, helping with the new sales. Um, pulled me out of that pretty quickly as well. <laughs> service advisor. Um, was a service advisor for about a year and then got pulled back to be the production manager. So I'm running the shop now. Um, kind of had my foot everywhere in this building, so no other way. Yeah, it seems like Camp is in. They know talent when they see it. So I know it's a complicated job that you're in now, but what gets you up every day and says, yeah, we got to go in there and get this done? Um, I love kind of what I do is puzzle piecing everything in. So making sure everybody stays happy. Right? Thanks for all your hard work. Thank you. Hey, Todd, thanks for being on the video today. Well, I know I've only been here 15 years and uh, you've educated me tons and you continue to do so and I'm very grateful for that. You know, it's amazing. There's been a lot of people here that I've met over the years that have been here for quite a while, such as yourself. What keeps you coming back to campus in every day and, and saying, yep, yeah, let's go face the music and get this job done? Well, as you all know out there in the world that the longer you put into it, the more knowledge you can gain, the more comfort level you have the more you can feel useful. I guess getting up every day is being able to come in and share what I've learned. And I can tell you that I've learned mainly by making mistakes. So being able to try to help others uh, prevent those mistakes and maybe give a quicker answer and a faster turnaround for our customer. You know, Todd Paquette, yep. Uh, I've been with Campers in 31 years. And uh, well, I've done a little bit of everything. But current position, I am a parts manager here at the Merrimack, New Hampshire location. 
and assisting with some of the regional stores. I get some self-gratification from being able to share the experience that I've uh, that I've learned, no matter what that might be. I know you've helped me a lot over the years. I am forever grateful, and my customers are absolutely grateful for the hard work that you put in. Thanks a lot, Todd. All right. Hi, my name's Lance. I'm a sales manager here in Merrimack. I've been in the sales manager position for about 11 years. Just, yeah, so a long time. Um, you know, I just love my job. I love the people that I've worked with. We have a great group of people here. It's very much a team atmosphere, and we help each other out, and we have a lot of fun helping folks uh, experience the uh, lifestyle of RVing. Oh, absolutely. You know, the thing that I get to, and, and I know, because you and I talk a lot, kind of on a semi-personal basis, is like, you know, we can kind of turn to each other for advice and, and you know, hey, how's life going on? It, it, you know, some of those moments, uh, I think, are probably the most precious out of them all. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And, uh, you know, what's most rewarding for, in my position is, is watching some of the newer team members grow in their positions and, and learn new people skills and uh, see them grow as, as young men as well and women. Of course. Yeah, I know it's amazing. Sometimes I'm a little like, Wow, I can't believe how fast these guys are learning, huh? It's a great, great place. I love coming here. I look forward to it every morning when I get out of bed. All right, man. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Hey, Amy. How's it going? Thank you. Yeah, thanks for joining me on this video today. You know, you've been around here for a little while now, right? You started yeah. where? What part of the company? Receptionist. Yeah, you, so we're here in Merrimack, and she was a receptionist for about how long? A uh, year and a half year and a half you know we loved you as a receptionist but what are you doing now I know you're sticking around you're doing a different job you're a detailer huh and what happens to you when you get here in the morning what time you get here eight or eight o'clock about eight o'clock yeah <laughs> you almost forgot that for a second <laughs> yeah and so when you're doing your job what kind of work is that detailing in, in title or in I clean inside the campus yeah you clean inside the campus right and it's kind of an important job because the camper is, uh, you know, the last thing the customer sees is the cleanliness of that camper when you when they're coming to pick up, right? So, you know, how do you know like you've done a good job? It looks good. I notice now that you're when you're doing the detailing work, you tend to laugh more, you tend to be happy. Like, what is it about that job that you enjoy? Being by myself and listening to music. All right, there you go. You can kind of just get into yeah. the groove of it, right? Well, thanks, and thanks for working with us at Campers in RV, and I hope you stick around for a lot more years. Thank you. Hey, Jesse, thanks for being on this video. How are you doing today? I'm doing just great, Bernie. Thanks for having me. Well, I started with Campers in back in uh, May of 2017. Uh, I'd known Jeff for a while, and I always admired the type of guy he was, and I wanted to work for, for his company. I didn't know they had lots of stores at the time. I thought it was just the store in Kingston that I'd driven by quite often. And when I found out there was 16 stores at the time, I was very impressed. When Jeff came around for the first time, I said to him, gee, Jeff, I never knew you were so big and you had 16 stores. He says, you never would have heard it from me. Which pretty much <laughs> sums up the type of sort of humble, modest guy he is. I went to Merrimack around the same time Greg did. All right. Uh, it was an opportunity to come to a bigger store with uh, some, you know, very nice product. And uh, I've had a great time. And this has been a wonderful experience. I, I like working for a company that I, that I believe in. And I, I believe in Campers in it. It's the, truly the trusted reason. So, yeah, my name is Greg Laskowski. I'm the general manager of the Merrimack location as well as the regional sales director for New England. I started off as a, a sales manager over at our Kingston location and worked my way up to general manager over there for the span of about uh, four or five years. And then I came over here in 2019 and joined you guys uh, in the big store here in Merrimack, New Hampshire. Yeah, it's been a good ride so far. So far, so good, yeah. So what are some of the you know biggest events that have occurred while you've been, you know, general manager over here in Merrimack? Well, um, you know, the Boston show is always a big event for us where we uh, we put up a huge number every year. It did. You know, we've had a, a, a lot of great years, a lot of ups and downs in the industry from, from COVID, almost feeling like it was going to shut us down, to the boom times, to then recovering from that. Right. Um, it's really been just a, a wild ride and, and, and a great ride with Campus. You know, we're very fortunate to have the team here, and I've been asking everybody, you know, what is it that brings you back every day? We have our challenges, like every other industry. Um, 
Being in the camping industry is awesome because we help people uh, create memories that'll last a lifetime, uh, get away with their families. And, you know, one of the great things about Camper Zen is the work-life balance compared to, you know, some other industries is we get to spend time with our families and, and, and do the camping and, and some of the things that, that we preach to our customers. So it's not just something that we say, it is something that's important to us at Camper Zen that, that you spend time with your families and create those memories for ourselves as well. Um, and it's just a, an atmosphere where we come every day and it almost doesn't feel like you're working. It feels like we're, we're here and we're having fun and, and make living at the same time, but it's really a great industry and a great company to work for. Yeah, I guess by us having a good work-life balance, it really helps us share that excitement with our customers as well. The memories that we're creating in our lives can help them create it in their lives too. 100%, and then that's why we like being here. Thanks a lot, Greg. Have a great day. Yeah. Hey, Ben, thanks for joining me today on the video. Uh, what, what do you got to say about our good buddy, Joe Patrici? Well, uh, Joe taught me everything I know today. When we first came here, we came from some similar, similar backgrounds, and uh, we had a lot in common. Um, he was friendly, he was knowledgeable, he was a, a great person to work with. You know, any of us that had the opportunity to be with him, uh, it was terrific. And you know, we got to the point where we even were hanging out at each other's houses and you know having meals together. Right. So it's a uh, tremendous honor to have met him and been part of his life. Yeah, he was an amazing guy and quite the storyteller too, huh? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, some of the stories that he told us, you know, from when he was a police officer and uh, in or just life in general, they were hilarious, entertaining, and really informative. It really gave us a great perspective yeah. about, you know, what we're all doing here. He was a great guy. He left lots of memories for all of us that are very happy. Thanks, Ben.